Dick Rochford here. Uh, for the Piper Meridian. This is a Avenine equipped and twin Garmin 430s. Very nice panel. Very easy to operate. What we're looking at here is the uh, round view with a center view and I like that Avenine gives us this capability. We can see traffic weather behind us or in front of us. We're making our way from St. Louis to Manassas, Virginia. And uh, widely scattered thunderstorms, rain showers, and only a few deviations. Uh, as I'm sure you know, you should not be using this next rad for tactical decision making. You know, it's fine for uh, when you can see out the window, but uh, if you're actually trying to navigate around rain showers with this, the time delay is going to get you in trouble, particularly at night or if you're an IMC. So looking at this, you can see we're approaching Wojo intersection with two cells to about our one to one one to two o'clock position. We look out there, and they're there, all right, but they're probably closer to um, one o'clock. If we were to turn the radar on, we'd be able to paint those. Right there. And we'd be able to verify that by putting the bearing pointer over them, switching to the, ver the profile mode and noting that they stand brown above the paint. In fact, there's another one out there beyond it. And that's at 10 right. So that's that's right over there. A little hard to see that out the window because they're mostly above it. But at this altitude, 270, we're way too cold to encounter any water. So we want to avoid water. One, two, three, four puddles of water there. We shouldn't be flying over them. And it's easy to see, fair enough, if we were to take this bearing pointer and scroll it to the left, we could find where those bumps go away. And here it turns out somewhere around uh, five left, and that's five left of our lubber line. And we're pretty much tracking our lubber line. We're tracking about four left. So what that tells me is this particular course will keep us free of water. And if we couldn't see outside, we'd have to bet our life on that. Looking outside, we could see that's absolutely true. That's the best way I know to use a tactical tool and a strategic tool at the same time. Dick Rochford, fly safely. Train off at 